afternoon baseball here on the show. Today we've got a good matchup in store between the San Diego Padres and the Colorado Rockies. Here's Juan Ligaris now. He's got a base hit tonight. And we are ready for some daytime baseball. Now the one and one pitch. Here's a hard hit ball to the left side that'll be taken in out there at short. Well done there. And the leadoff man is retired to start the afternoon. Here now the 2 2. Line drive to left. And that finds the outfield grass for a base hit. And now it'll rattle up against the wall. The relay. And he will beat the throw into second as he slides in safely with a one out double. The left fielder, Tommy Pham. Into the box now, Tommy Pham. A little bit outside, two and one. Drill down the line. But this will be a foul ball as that evens things at two and two. And he tries to get him to reach for it, but it stays outside three and two. You would think in this situation, maybe with a base open, he'd just pitch around him and put him on first. But not with the guy in the on deck circle. He's going to attack this hitter. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with only one away. Up next is Fernando Tatis Jr. First at bat for him in this one. It was one for four with a double in the ball game last night. Swing and a line drive. And this is going to wind up as extra bases as that'll play one for sure and maybe a second. And the throw in gets away from him. He pulls into third safely as they take the lead with two runs scoring on the play. The third baseman, number 13, Manny Machado. So now to the plate, Manny Machado. This one's chopped foul right at the plate. The count moves now to one and two. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. High in the air down the right field line. After it is Blackman, but this will land untouched. And he looks at one that misses, and that's an excellent job of making his man throw a lot of pitches as he toughs out a walk. The right fielder, number four. Digging in now for San Diego, Will Myers. And the Padres trying to make this first inning even better here. The 1-1. Timing just to tick off there as this one's fouled off to the right. In the dirt and block behind the plate. And a nice job to keep the runners at bay as the count moves to two and two. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, it's gone. And nearly a three run shot. Instead, it's a foul ball. The two two one more time is a breaking ball that misses off the plate. He's not having his best outing in this one. And I think that curveball is part of the reason why. He couldn't get on top of that one, and that's not the first time that's happened. And that'll get down out there. And that'll bring home run number three. It's now a 3 nothing cushion. Batting seven. The second baseman, Brian Dozier. Into the box, Brian Dozier. Two balls and a strike to Dozier. Chopper to first might only get one, but this will wind up a foul ball. Two and two. Swung on in the dirt for the third strike. 
Good job to corral this quickly as the runners hold on. Batting eight. Striding in, Francisco Mejia. A couple of hits for him in four trips to the plate last night. Oh, and he dialed that one down and got him to swing through it. It's one and two now. It's a two and two count to the Padres catcher. Pretty good breaking ball to lay off of right there. If I'm pitching, I might think this guy might be sitting on something off speed. But the runner's back easily. And the curveball bounces here, but a good job behind the plate to keep it at arm's length. The 3 2 pitch. There's a swing and a high deep drive headed for the right field corner. And that's going to wind up hooking just a bit foul, so a missed opportunity there. Another full count pitch on its way. And another foul ball. The next 3 2. Hard hit ball to second. Throw on to first, and they're able to escape the monster inning as the side is retired. Settling in now, Rymel Tapia. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Hey! to two balls and two strikes now. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball. And there's one away. So the base is empty here with one away. And up next, postseason record holder Daniel Murphy. Snatched out of midair at first base for route number two. That is good. And that'll bring in Nolan Arenado. Head-to-head -head numbers against Zach Davies. He's only two for ten. He also has one home run. Hit in the air down the right field line. But this is going to wind up a foul ball. And this will miss down low in the dirt, so he's worked it full now at three and two. And a good job there to lay off. It's ball four as he becomes their first base runner of the ball game now with two away. Arenado is off of first with two away. He pops him up toward the left side of the infield. And Machado will make the catch here, and that ends the inning. Up next, it'll be the pitcher for the Padres, Zach Davies. He'll get us started in the top of the second. One of the keys to securing a win, they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. There's a fastball well off the plate for a ball. Swing and a miss as he ran the fastball right by him for the first out. Here's Juan Ligares. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Into the windup. Here comes the 2-2 pitch. And he popped him up. Back into foul territory behind first. But this will land untouched. A 2-2 two two count. Here's the pitch. Hit back up the middle. Scorey picks it up. Throw in time at first for out number two. So bases are empty here with two gone. And standing in, here's the first baseman, Eric Hosmer. Well hit to right, but a foul ball. Two out lightning definitely applies to this offense. If this two-hole hitter can get on, they could start something serious. 
And he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. In now for Colorado, David Dahl, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Hey, we're still in the early stages in this one. They're only down by a couple of runs, but it's really key for this leadoff guy to try to get on and get a big inning started. One and two now. And he got him. Trevor Story steps in now. He's been productive at the plate in the series with six hits coming into this one. The 2-2. Two -two. Swung on and missed. He got him on strikes. Striding in for the Rockies, Garrett Hampson. First two men in the inning have both gone down via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. A ball and two strikes now. And he struck him out. So a fine inning here as he strikes out this side in order. Next to the plate for the Padres, Tommy Pham. He's hitting at a 500 clip in the series coming into this one. Five hits in 10 tries. Hit to third. Arenado has it. And the throw pulls the first baseman off the bag, and he's safe at first. So here's the cleanup hitter, Fernando Tatis Jr. He scored after tripling in his first plate appearance. What's he got in store for us here? Padres shortstop ahead with a three ball one strike count. That's a great call right there. Fastball away with a guy who's got some jets on first base. Almost like a hybrid pitch out. Great for a catcher if that guy's running. Easy transfer throw to second base. Therefore it is Blackman and he's got it for the first out. And in steps Manny Machado. Manny Machado. The 2-1 pitch. And he hits the corner with that one. Two and two. You can bet he wants that one back at the plate right now. That's a pitch you normally see a guy drive if he has the right approach going. Fams off and running. Lifted into the air out towards center field. Tapia is there. Two gone. Here's Will Myers. Now batting. Right fielder. Will Myers. Fans off and running. Pitch outside. The throw is going to be far too late. That's a stolen base. He's set and the 2 1 pitch. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Dahl will reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move, and that ends the inning. Late Dom Nunez. He went deep in the contest last night. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Swing and a drive to right. There it goes. See you later. Over the wall, a home run. In now, Jeff Hoffman. Is put in play to the right side of the infield. On the first, so a good bounce back pitch there as he gets the ground ball for the first out. Riding in once again, Rymel Tapia, 0 for 1 here in the early going. Gets the sign, here comes the 2 1. Ball, second time. And this misses for ball four. The second walk he surrendered here in the first three innings. Here's Daniel Murphy now. Hit it hard but lined out in his first at bat. Yeah, pretty unlucky right there, Matty. Squared up a fastball nicely, and that's all you can do. You just want to be on time for the heater, and he's prepared for this next A.B. He's running. Again, he sends it out of play. Runner at first here, one man out. Yeah. 
This one's outside quite a bit off the plate that time. Now this guy's a grinder. Fouls off good pitches and doesn't seem to swing at the ones just off the corner. This guy's a pitcher's nightmare. Full count three and two. Now the payoff pitch home. Swing line drive. That's going to be trouble. Tapia rounds the corner and is headed home. Now the relay home. And not in time as he just crosses the plate in time. Now batting, third baseman, Nolan. Standing in now, Nolan Arenado. Hit pretty well out toward right center field. Lagara is giving chase. He gets there and makes a fine running play for the second out. Here's Charlie Blackman now as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Hit the target but this is low two and one. Hard hit ball to second. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Digging in now, Brian Dozier. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs. Sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. Fastball called strike three and there's the first out of the inning. Now in the box Francisco Mejia. He's 0 for 1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. Inside and low 2 and 1. We're in the fourth 3 to 2 is our score. Lifted the other way down the left field line. Dahl's in pursuit, and that gets down, and we'll see if that's extra bases. And he is in at second base with a one-out double. Now batting, the pitcher, Zach Davies. To the plate now, Zach Davies. Fastball right back to the mound. And he'll send it on to first, and that'll freeze the runner at second with two away now. The San Diego batting order turns over and set to go. Juan Ligares, runner in scoring position with Sugan. The bouncer to the left side. Fielded cleanly. Throw to Murphy will take care of him, and that'll end the inning. And that'll bring up the speedy outfielder, David Dahl. And a big cut at the breaking ball, but he comes up empty, and that's the first out. So digging in now, Trevor Story. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Rip toward the gap in right. He's around first, heading for two. And he'll reach second now with one away. The ball, number one. At the plate now, Garrett Hampson in there, and it's even now, two and two. And this misses, so that'll fill the count at three and two. Dom Nunez, the number eight hitter here, waits on deck. This is in the air to left. Sam is going to get there as he backs up to put it away. And there are two gone now. Coming to the plate now, Dom Nunez. And he's off to a hot start in this one. Homered his first time around. Goes to show you how strong this guy is. That wasn't a bad breaking ball that he hit for a home run and at last at bat. That ball was down in a way. He went out and hooked it and pulled it. This guy's definitely a good hitter. Here's the two and two. A swing and a miss on a ball way outside the strike zone, and the inning is over.
Jairo Diaz is into the ball game now as he'll make his fifth appearance of the season here. New inning set to get underway. Eric Hosmer to the plate now. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. Yeah, and this is the guy for me. I, I think this is the guy in the clubhouse that the guys truly gravitate towards. The total package of Eric Hosmer's game is really special. Fastball right back to the mound. And he'll flip on to first to record the out. Digging in once again, Tommy Pham. 0 for 1 with a run scored thus far. Hit sharply on the ground to the left. And that'll just sneak past his outstretched arm, a base hit. Now back. Now a throw over to first. And a dive, but he's back in. Into the box now, Fernando Tatis Jr. Struck him out. Now that third baseman, Manny McDonald. Here's the one and one pitch. Count is two and one. He's fallen behind now, three and one. They know the threat this guy possesses at the plate. I know it's 3 1 in this situation right here, but I can't imagine anything comes over the heart of the plate. 3 and 2 now. And a good at bat that time as he lays off for ball four. And as a result, that'll move a runner up into scoring position now with two away. Looking to keep this a one run game, the pitch. Good deception on the slider there as he's way out in front. And a full count as that misses. It's three and two now. For the guy in the mound, this is one of those innings where nothing comes in. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Josh Fuentes will get the call here as he'll hit for the pitcher. Number eight, Josh Fuentes. Into center field, line drive base hit. Now batting. center fielder. Line ball. Into the box, Rymel Tapia. He pulls this one high and deep to right center field. And that is off the wall. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the inning. Stepping in now, Daniel Murphy pulled toward right center field. Ligares on the run, and this one will bounce into the wall. And the second run will score as the lead will change hands now at four to three. Up next to Colorado. The third baseman, Nolan. At the plate, Arantado. Nolan Arenado. Oh, and not an easy pitch to lay off of, but he did somehow, and he's got it to three and one. Doesn't want any part of that cutter, and it's full three and two. Now the payoff pitch home. And he misses there for ball four. So runners are at first and second now with nobody out. Drew Pomeranz comes on now in an awfully difficult situation as there are two on here with nobody out. Charlie Blackman will be his first test out of the bullpen. And it will be a tough test indeed as he'll face him with two on and nobody out here. 1-1. One, one. Misses ball two. Hey, lots of guys get too aggressive in a spot like this, but he's done a nice job of gaining some count leverage. Look for him to put the ball and play hard. To two and two now. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the first out. 
Now at the plate, David Dahl. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. And he misses with that one. Ball four. And that's going to load the bases now with still only one away. Ready once again, Trevor Story. It was a two bagger for him in his last at bat. And he's got to build off that last A.B. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches, you'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the, the fact that he was able to work double a double ball. in last at bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. Fastball, and hmm, looks like they're pinching him a bit here. It's three and one. Everyone in the ballpark knows what the pitcher's intentions are in this situation. Great job at the plate to lay off a tough pitch in a good spot. And that misses. Ball four. Three. A run will come yeah. in to score. No, yeah. Rounded down the third baseline. Taken in by Machado. Dozier on to Hosmer. A double play, and that ends the inning. Wade Davis takes over to start the sixth inning on the mound. For the number 71. Top half of the sixth about to get started. Brian Dozier at the plate. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. Now a fastball gets the upper part of the zone for strike two. Outside in a full count, three and two. Francisco Mejia will be next. Hit the other way out toward right field. Blackman on the move. He's there and records the first down. So striding forward now, Francisco Mejia. He doubled his last time through. It's fouled away. Three runs, five hits, no errors in the ball game for the Padres. A swing and a miss. He offered it a ball way outside the strike zone for out number two. Greg Garcia will get the call to pinch hit here as we'll see what he can do with two out and the base is empty. And he fouls this one off. Ball and two strikes. Here it is. Skied into straightaway right. After it is Blackman. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. Luis Perdomo enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 61. Sam Hilliard is going to come off the bench as he'll be asked to lead off the bottom of inning number six. This is low, ball two, two and one. Two and two. The pitch. Ah, uh, got him swinging on the split finger pitch, and that's out number one. Now back to the now top back. of the lineup, Get stepping in, Rymel Tapia, one for two in the ball game thus far. Nope. And he lays off this one down and in for ball two. Fastball right back to the mound. And he'll just flip this on to first for the second out of the inning. Digging in and looking for more, Daniel Murphy he drove in two runs on a double in his last half bat. Now the payoff pitch home. Swing and a ball sliced, fouled into the seats down the left field line. The next 3-2. 
Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. Now batting, third baseman, Nolan. So now to the plate, Nolan Arenado lifted in the air out towards left center. Left fielder giving chase. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. Carlos Estevez is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 54. Seventh inning ready to roll. Coming to the plate now, Juan Ligares. He struggled at the top of the lineup in this one, hitless to this point. The 1-1. One, one. That was some gas. Triple digits on the radar gun. Grounded back up the middle. And that'll get on by into center field for a leadoff single. The first Standing Eric. in now, Eric Hosmer. Oh. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Waiting on it is Dahl. One away. Now batting, now Tommy back. Pham. He so singled his last time up. Tommy. Three runs, yeah. six hits. No errors in the ballgame for the Padres. A oh, double play ball to second. Four, six, three. It's a double play, and the inning is over. For the traditional Greg Stammen will come on and make now his fourth appearance in this campaign. Number 34. Greg. Last Damn. half of the seventh here. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Charlie Blackman. No thump out of him in this game so far, as might be expected. He's 0 for 3. Strike swinging, timing a little off on that one. That misses, and we're even at two and two. The classic back foot slider right there with two strikes. Usually gets a ton of swing and misses. Nice layoff right there. Fight for another pitch. Fouled away. And they're working the outer half here, but that one's wide for ball three. Well, that's a nasty breaking ball right there. Back door slider. Just missed the corner. As they say, that's a Hall of Fame pitch. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. The 3 2 one more time is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. David Dahl to the plate now. Now batting, left fielder, David. Hit sharply on the ground. And that gets through for a one-out base hit. Running hard. He's digging for second. And he's in there easily at second with a one-out double. Now batting. Good stop. Rubber. Story. In now, Trevor Story. High and deep to right center. Myers going back. And this will get all the way out toward the 375 sign now. And this will score the run from second to make this a 7-3 game now. Throw to third, but he's in there. As also on the play, a run comes across to score. To the plate now, Garrett Hampson. Hard hit ball to short. Oh, what a stop on the slide. And the throw will be wide at first as it pulls him off the bag, and a run's going to score. So it's a runner at first as a result of the throwing error. And now it'll be the catcher, Dom Nunez. Now the one and one pitch. Pitch swung out and missed the throw. Is in time as Mejia got him on a great throw. Look out. That one almost got away from him. Two and two now. And this.
pass misses, so that'll fill the count at three and two. Now the payoff pitch home. Slap hard the opposite way. And the Rockies just keep right on rolling as this ought to be extra bases again. And he'll coast into second here with a two out double. Ryan McMahon will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Number 24. Inside with the slider, and that'll back him up a bit. Frozen on strike three for the final out of the inning. Brian Shaw been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 29. Ready to begin the eighth. So coming to the plate, Fernando Tatis Jr. is working on a one for three thus far. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. The short hit hard. Story scoops it up. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. The first base Stepping in and ready for another shot, Manny Machado. It was a walk in his last trip. A little bit outside, two and one. Shaw was known as a short relief specialist, a guy who came in, got one or two big outs, but with the new pace of play rules, they're forcing a change for this right-hander. One out, nobody on. Line to the right side. A leaping try, but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. And this one scoots all the way to the wall. Now batting, right fielder, Will Myers. Stepping in now, Will Myers. A one and two count to Will Myers. Ground ball foul down the left side. He'll try again one two. And that one misses badly. It's ball two. Swing and a miss there on a late breaking slider as he set down on strikes for the second time this afternoon. Ready for another chance? Brian Dozier. He flew out in his last at bat. And this one runs a little too far in. Ball two. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. Oh, he missed a home run by a matter of feet. It's off the wall. Now back, second, Francisco Mejia. At the plate, Francisco Mejia. Cut fastball that time, but he doesn't bite, and now it's three and one. Here's the game within the game. You have a better matchup on deck. You got a three-one count in this situation. Don't be afraid to put him on base and attack the next guy. Now the payoff pitch home. And that misses ball four. So it's first and second now with two out. James Pazos enters the ball game out of the pen looking for the final out here in the top of inning number eight. Josh Naylor will start to loosen up in the on-deck circle as he'll bat with two on and two out here. And that's into the corner a foul ball in right. Two down runners at first and second. Just staying alive putting together a really good at bat here.
Here he comes again, 1 2. Rolled slowly down the third baseline. Throw to first in time, and the big inning is avoided as the side is retired. Jose Castillo is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 65. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. So the Rockies lineup turns over and to the plate. Rymel Tapia. He was a ground out victim last time up. And that misses two and one. Fouled off. The 2 2. And just when you needed a shutdown inning, a leadoff walk was certainly not on the agenda. He needs a bear down right here. A bouncer up the middle. And a base hit, so the leadoff man is on to begin the inning. The first baseman, number nine. Into the box Daniel. now, Daniel Murphy. Murphy. A bouncer to the left side. And that finds its way through for a base hit. Throw comes in quickly from left, so even on the hit and run, they'll hold thanks to first now and back. second here. No Into the box, Nolan oh, Arenado oh. to one and two now. Two balls, two strikes to Nolan Arenado. Number three hole hitter up right now. Cleanup guy on deck. Two ball, two strike count. I think pitcher wants to make something happen right here. Hit on the ground to third. There's one. Over to Hosmer. A double play. And that'll bring in Charlie Blackman. Loud contact there, but it's well fouled. The one two. Now this is driven out to deep right center. This could be trouble. Now this will rattle up against the wall. And they'll extend their lead even further as the runs in to score from third. Now a 9 4 ball game. Now that no At the plate now, David Dahl. Two and one to David Dahl. Three and one to the Rockies left fielder. Two out here and a runner at second. Swing, strike two. That's just too much velocity upstairs to get good wood on it. It's going to have to lower his sights. And that misses ball four, so it's first and second now with two out. Kirby Yates trots in from the bullpen here as he inherits a tough spot with two on and two away. Trevor Story will be his first assignment here as he'll face him with runners at first and second and two away. Now the 2 1 pitch. Popped him up. And he will indeed make the play in foul territory to retire the side. Riding into the box, Juan Ligares. It was a single for him in his last at bat. Two and one to Juan Ligares. Three and one. Good job to work the count and put himself back in the driver's seat. Started off with one strike, and now he's got to count his favor three and one. Ground ball sent back up the middle. Story brings it in. Throw on to first for the out, and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. First baseman Eric Hosmer is in. He comes into this appearance in the midst of a one for four day. The one and two pitch. Sent on the ground out to second. Throw on to first, and the Padres are down to their final out now. Stepping into the box, Tommy Pham. He comes to the plate as the last chance for his side. Two out here in the ninth.
way outside nearly to the backstop two and one. And there's a called strike two as now they're down to their final strike this afternoon. San Diego down to their final strike. Hit sharply on the ground. That's through for a base hit, his second of the ball game. The battle, the book guy. Fernando and now Tatis. Fernando Tatis Jr. And it's fouled away. Now this crowd of over 38,000 on their feet. Outside and a full count, three and two. Manny Machado would be next if they can keep this inning alive. Now a swing and a ground ball. This should do it. Throw to first here will be in time for the final out. And the Rockies have put an end to their four-game slide as this ball game is over. Well, just an excellent job right here closing this one out. He just collected the first save of his career. Got to start somewhere. And this ball game ends at a 9-4 final score. Colorado used a nice fifth inning to take the lead, and they never gave it back. Jairo Diaz gets the win in relief, his second of the year. Zach Davies was only able to work four innings as he takes the loss. James Pazos gets a four-out save, his first of the year. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. The final line score for the ball game this afternoon for the victorious Rockies. Nine runs on 13 hits. One error, they left 10 men on base. For the Padres, four runs on nine hits. One error, they left 10 men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 41 minutes. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon. And we remind you to please drive home safely.